Kinsey, how's the information you got on the Deckers coming? It's compiling. So what's next? Not talking over the phone now. Too many people could be listening. Okay. Smiling Jax. Go there. Okay. You should be more careful. I saw you coming two blocks ago. Traffic cameras. They're everywhere in this town. Good to know. I'm serious. You should toss out your fancy overpriced phone. I can find you through that, too. Yeah, look, I feel kind of weird having a conversation like this. Totally agree. We should be using, like, that Navajo code dialect. Come up for air. I took care of the Deckers. Sure. Let down your guard and suddenly they make it look like you're selling secrets to Mossad and moonlighting as a dominatrix. You've created a big enough disruption for you to move on, Matt Miller. But if you want the Deckers gone, like really gone, there's a lot of work to do. All right. I'll hit you up if I need any more help. Remember, throw out your phone! Next time, I'm picking the lunch place. Wow, pretty good. How can I help you? I need your opinion on Viola de Winter. My personal opinion is that she's a useless whore. Professionally, however, she could have valuable information if she can be trusted. That's the real question, isn't it? Well, that's good timing. Hold on, Oleg. I'd like to meet if you'd be willing. Not fucking likely. I helped you hurt the Morning Star. Didn't that prove to you I'm a woman of my word? People can go a long way to be assholes. I'm tired of fighting against the Saints. Meet me, and maybe you'll realize that. Come on, Oleg. Time to find some answers. I didn't realize you were a patron of the arts, Viola. We never really had the chance to chat. What, with you being a science experiment? I wouldn't piss off the big guy. <sighs> Look, I'm not here to fight. We need to work together. Right. Johnny's dead because of you. Johnny's dead because he thought he could do everything on his own. So what's in it for you? I get to watch Kilbane suffer. Can you play nice? I am always gentleman. What is that? Nothing good. Let's go.
Ladies first. Kia, status. The Saints have taken cover with one of the De Winter sisters. We're about to move in. Roger that. Contact me once you secure the area. Yes, Commander. Let's hope the front's clear. Who were those guys? Soldiers of some sort, though I don't recognize the uniforms. Merc's working for Kilbane, maybe? He thinks his luchadors are unstoppable. I doubt he'd ask them to sit this out. So someone else wants us dead. Fun. This isn't any better. This place looks surrounded. What kind of jets are those? They've cut the power to the elevator. I'll see if I can fix it. They're dropping soldiers off up here. Wow. Large fella. I love action. Impressive friend. 
tech familiar? It's me, Lepede Gray. Way beyond the private sector. So that's bad, right? A little. More of those high-tech jets! theme in this city. You sure you can get us there? I'm sure I can try. That was fun. Don't get cocky. doesn't have the pull to organize something on this scale. I don't think they're just targeting us. Then who called them in? I'll worry about that later. Right now, I'm a bit busy. Stay low until we get there. My name is Cyrus Temple, commander of the Special Tactical Anti-Gang Unit. 
I'm here to answer your questions about the Stag Initiative. Okay, so how long, Judy, sir, one question, please. How long will Stag be occupying Steelport? There is no occupation. We have the full support of Mayor Reynolds. How will Stag impact our daily lives? When we win the war on urban terror, you and your families will be safe again. Sir, that's not what I asked. Let me tell you about Jessica Parrish, a girl from Stillwater who ran away from home to be with her tough guy boyfriend. Jessica thought her life was pretty sweet until a gangbanger kidnapped her, threw her in the trunk of a car, and laughed as her boyfriend crushed her in a monster truck rally. If Jessica Parrish was your daughter, how far would you want me to go? Thank you for your time.